Medicare. I do not have a slide for Medicare, so I will hide those. Uh, Medicare started this year by breaking his silence on Ralph. Uh, it was a long contention of mine that if anyone had fucked up as bad as Ethan Ralph did, Medicare would be making fun of him. And Medicare had remained very quiet about Ethan Ralph, and people gave me shit for this and said, like, well, you can't, like, if you, like, ask him to, like, make fun of Ralph, then he'll just never make fun of Ralph. And I said, no, I think there's something else there. Um, but in January of this year, uh, Ethan and Ralph finally managed to to get Medicare to start making fun of him, uh, which was a a welcomed change of pace, I suppose. Uh, and then he started streaming. He got off Twitter. He got banned on Twitter by Keffels, so he joined uh, Post. I think he's active on Post still. Um, seems to be having fun doing small streams on Otis Need and talking to people on Post, watching anime. Uh, has hinted that he might stop streaming. Actually, someone said that he went to, he offered, either offered or someone asked him to play a game of things. He said he'd like to play like a Swedish, like robot game that I've never heard of called like Generation Zero or some shit. No idea if that's even true. Um, Maybe. Just not for the next couple weeks. Um, But he said he might stop streaming because I, presumably because of his health, which uh, sucks. Sucks to hear that. So I don't really have anything funny to say about it. Actually, he had his argument with no, oh, the Nick thing. He had his argument with Nick Fuentes where Nick was just like, yeah, crime is based. Uh, yeah. And, and it was like the worst fucking argument. And I stayed up to like four in the morning to listen to this shit. And it was just atrocious. But through no fault of his own, uh, Nick, Nick just didn't t- Nick like invited him to have a debate and then just didn't take it seriously and acted like a retard and said stupid shit for three hours. And I was like, okay. Um, so my, oh, he had the intervention stream with Ralph too. That was, that was the gym highlight of the year. Uh, Jim had a conversation with Ralph. Ralph was pissed drunk and he literally cried talking about how much Jim meant to him. That was, that was pretty fucking funny. That was, uh, unfortunately, uh, it was not a, a bolder moment, but it was pretty close and it was, was pretty funny, pretty gratifying to listen. Ralph literally, literally cried. Why didn't you call me? <laughs> and uh, my 2023 prediction for Jim Medeker is he will find a way to quit anime, which and, and uh, suddenly, after quitting anime, after swearing it off, his health will miraculously improve. There will be no explanation for it. Doctors will be baffled. They never found out what's wrong with him, but for some reason, as soon as he stopped watching anime... He got better and better, and he's back to 100% by the end of 2023. Lock it in. That's my prediction for Medicare. Let's go. 